This week we've seen highlight after highlight with athletes putting their bodies on the line along with some record-breaking performances. Let, with that being said, let's take a look at this week's top plays. Starting on the pitch with play five century, the big lead over Wilson in the first half. Aiden Fisher on the attack for the Patriots, putting on the moves with a back, with a cut back, firing on net with the left foot, scoring, centering, netting 13 goals in a big win over Williston. Sticking with soccer for number four, Minot taking on Legacy Majet's Emerson Perrin with possession, crossover with the touch, firing from distance with her left foot, sneaky pass a diving Berlin Felkley, tickling the twine for a goal. Minot off to a 3-0 start to the season. Moving to the diamond for number three, Bismarck State softball taking on Williston State. This line drives to center, looks like it's going to drop, but Don Baker says, not in my house, making the diving catch to take away a hit. What a grab from the Mystic center fielder. Over to baseball for number two, Bismarck battling Williston. Demons with a game time run in scoring position. Tanner Grossclose, fly ball opposite field. Garrett Solberg lays out to make the diving grab, preserving the lead for the Coyotes. That may be the play of the year so far from spring sports. In our top play of the week, courtesy of Mystics Baseball, BSC's Carson Zimmel dominating against Dawson, throwing a one-hit complete game shutout with a record-breaking 18 strikeouts to field the Mystics to a 1-0 win over the Buccaneers. He recorded 18 of the 21 outs via punch-out. That's video game numbers if I've ever seen them. Zimmel taking the top spot in our top plays of the week.